At last, the engine saga is over. It took about three hours on a Friday evening to go from no engines to complete maneuvering engines and mains. So if I try and move down, my four maneuvering engines try and figure out what to do, and you can see that the ones on top fire. Try and move up, the ones on the bottom fire. Try and move left, try and move right. And right now, our throttle is set to zero, so it generally is not trying to move in any direction, and we're basically zeroing out our velocity. But we can turn all thr our throttle on, at which point the maneuvering engines will actually try to help our primary engines. So here you can see us in scene view, where we can take a look at all of our engines. The main engines point backwards straight. That's, that's all they do. They can't be rotated or moved or gimbaled and the maneuvering engines are now pointed backwards as far as they can go which is 45 degrees so because they're balanced we continue to move in the correct way we are nicely balanced and they will help us accelerate but notice that if I were to move like this uh, they well we're trying to go really really fast here there we are they would try to kill our horizontal velocity our lateral velocity while our main engines continue to try and accelerate us forwards so they can help us to kill off our lateral velocity and keep us on target. That's kind of what they're there for. Right now, the rotation is free. Uh, I plan to maybe integrate the maneuvering engines into rotation later. Right now, it's definitely just in test mode. But I thought I would show you how easy this was. Um, you've seen every step of this process. It was three videos, and that's how long it took me. Have a good one. Oh, there's no sound effects yet. That's fine.